Welcome to Tales and Tongue. Today, we'll be practicing our listening and speaking skills. We'll also learn some useful vocabulary and expressions commonly used in everyday life. Our story for today is My Last Night Dream. Listen carefully. Hello, everyone. My name is Monica, and I want to explain my last night dream with you. Last night, I had this cool dream. Imagine a place where people don't talk with words, but use art instead. It was like living in a big painting world. Colors floated around and shapes told stories. I found myself in a meadow where everyone was painting a sunset. We didn't talk. We just used brushes and colors. It felt like we all understood each other without saying a thing. Our paintings showed how much we loved that sunset. Even when people didn't agree, it wasn't about arguing with words. We just used different colors and strokes to show our feelings. It was like arguing with paintings instead of talking. In my dream, I met someone who made sculptures that told stories, but I could understand them by looking at their sculptures. It was like the sculptures were talking to me without words. When I woke up, the art world disappeared and normal words came back. But I felt like I wanted to live in a world where everything could be a painting and every feeling could be a color. It was just a dream, but it felt real, like going to a magical place where you can use your imagination to paint everything. Interesting vocabulary. Let's learn some useful and interesting vocabulary from the story we have just covered to improve our English. Float. If something floats, it moves slowly through the air or stays up in the air. Example, leaves floated gently down from the trees. Meadow A field with wild grass and flowers. Example, Monica found herself in a meadow where everyone was painting a sunset. A sculpture An object made out of stone, wood, clay and etc. by an artist. Example, local artists were asked to create sculptures for the garden. Disappeared, to become impossible to see any longer. Example, the sun had disappeared behind a cloud. Arguing, to disagree with someone in words, often in an angry way. Example, Player continued to argue with the referee throughout the game. Hello everyone. Hello everyone. My name is Monica and I want to explain my last night dream with you. My name is Monica, and I want to explain my last night dream with you. Last night I had this cool dream. Last night I had this cool dream. Imagine a place where people don't talk with words, but use art instead. Imagine a place where people don't talk with words, but use art instead. It was like living in a big painting world. It was like living in a big painting world. Colors floated around and shapes told stories. Colors floated around and shapes told stories. I found myself in a meadow. I found myself in a meadow. Where everyone was painting a sunset. Where everyone was painting a sunset. We didn't talk. We didn't talk. 
We just use brushes and colors. We just use brushes and colors. It felt like we all understood each other without saying a thing. It felt like we all understood each other without saying a thing. Our paintings showed how much we loved that sunset. Our paintings showed how much we loved that sunset. Even when people didn't agree. Even when people didn't agree. It wasn't about arguing with words. It wasn't about arguing with words. We just used different colors and strokes to show our feelings. We just used different colors and strokes to show our feelings. It was like arguing with paintings instead of talking. It was like arguing with paintings instead of talking. In my dream. In my dream. I met someone who made sculptures that told stories. I met someone who made sculptures that told stories. But I could understand them by looking at their sculptures. But I could understand them by looking at their sculptures. It was like the sculptures were talking to me without words. It was like the sculptures were talking to me without words. When I woke up, when I woke up, the art world disappeared. The art world disappeared. And normal words came back. And normal words came back. But I felt like I wanted to live in a world. But I felt like I wanted to live in a world where everything could be a painting. Where everything could be a painting. And every feeling could be a color. And every feeling could be a color. It was just a dream. It was just a dream. But it felt real. But it felt real. Like going to a magical place. Like going to a magical place. where you can use your imagination to paint everything. Where you can use your imagination to paint everything.